Mm. All right, let's try it. Oh, sh I used my left hand. <laughs> you are wrong. I am not good at this yet. Best Ever Food Review Show has become world renowned for innovating the food review game. Like that time I had a drinking culture exchange and taught Cambodian villagers how to shotgun a beer. Yeah! <laughs> what a f***ing champion! Or that time I reviewed Jollibee in a bee suit on the back of a motorbike. Hey man, you want a pie? You want a pie? It's yummy. It's yummy. Try it. Nang? Nang home? Yeah! It's yummy! <laughs> There's also that time I gave people free rides in a jeepney as long as they would sing a song. Um, guys, you're, you're all making this very awkward. A food review so innovative that it didn't even include any actual food. This video is going viral, at least 2 million views. Okay, well, not every idea has worked out perfectly, but this time I have a real winner. How's your road rage? Do you ever get really angry when you're driving? Uh. Everyone wants to try local food, but they don't want other tourists swarming the same area, ruining their local experience. So today I recruited two lively and talkative taxi drivers. Uh, how often do you have uh, some a big camera in your back seat? and then you make a show about food. It's the first time. Oh, this is the first time? Yes. Oh. In an effort to hunt down the most localist local food, these guys will show me where it's at. Let's get started. Good morning. Hi. Thank you for agreeing to my weird idea. Oh, Almost no. all my ideas fail, so let's see what happens with this one. The foodie mission in Kuala Lumpur continues, and today we woke up bright and early in search of a filling breakfast. Today, you're taking me out for breakfast. Uh -huh. What's your normal spot, your, your kind of uh, usual food for breakfast? Uh, normally, for Malay, they like to eat uh, nasi lemak. Okay. Or coconut rice. We will go to Kampung Baru. Kampung, and that's uh, like a Malaysian uh, street it, food street? Yeah, 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 it's a Malaysian settlement over there. Our first guide will be Matt, a local driver who's been hitting these streets day in and day out. The place we're going now, Kampung Baru, is that a place you go to usually? Uh, normally, quite famous, uh, Nasi Lemak. Is it hard to talk and drive at the same time? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> oh, wow, there's a whole line of people. Uh, yeah, nasi, let's do it. Uh, what manjo, what? Let's do this. Match breakfast spot of choice, Nasi Lemak Wanjo. Starting out as a humble food cart, this place is killing it 40 years later, as evidenced by the long line of hungry patrons. Wow, so look how popular this place is. <laughs> there are a ton of people in line here. Do you think they're gonna be cool with the camera? Uh, no way, they're all Malay people, all friendly people. Friendly people. <laughs> All right, I believe you 100%. <laughs> that is my experience so far. We've just rocked up here at the local Malay restaurant. There's a huge line of people. You just pull out whatever food uh, you want? Yeah, just okay. pick up uh, beef, uh, chicken, squid, prawn, everything. Squid? I like the idea of squid for breakfast. Let's uh, do this. And now we wait. How are they going to lift up that rice? A uh, lot of people. Girl power. power, huh? Wonder Woman. <laughs> Yeah, ladies, let's go. Look at this. Oh my god, yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's gotta be heavy as heck. That's awesome. Nasi lemak, they put a pandan leaf. Pandan. pandan leaf, more like a vanilla flavor. Nasi lemak is a fragrant rice cooked with coconut milk and pandan leaf. This is an absolute staple in Malaysia. I can smell it already. The rice is really fragrant. Wow, look at this line. Yeah. <laughs> That's, and this is coconut rice. Uh, coconut rice. Okay. This was sambal. The base nasi lemak includes a heaping scoop of fluffy coconut rice, a hot chili paste called sambal, a hard boiled egg, some fried anchovies, and cucumbers. This comes in at three ringgit. From there, you can pile on other sides like squid, chicken, or beef. But you have to pay more monies for those. That one? Uh, lungs, uh, beef lung. Oh, I want some beef lung. Okay, I'll take some beef lung. Squid and then. Squid, okay. Oh, there we go. She's chopping up that squid. Mm. That looks yummy. Today we'll be getting squid, fried cow lung, and curried beef. Time to eat. Wow, look at that. We got our food. Let's go find a place to sit. Is it weird eating with a camera here? Is that weird? 
Ah, yeah. For, yeah, for the I'm first sorry. experience, no problem. I think you're doing a great job. <laughs> okay. I'm used to it by now. Here we have our beautiful dish. Let's try yeah. some cow lung. Mmm. That's some pretty good cow lung. I love the texture, really chewy. Yeah. So you get like a little chili. So you just mix a little bit of everything. Ah, uh, yeah. One spoon, yeah. <laughs> so coconut rice, some eggs, some chili. Mm -hmm. We'll put some squid on there. Mm -hmm. And try it all in one big bite. Yeah. Mmm. Oh, that rice yeah, is outstanding. Can... Super fluffy. You know, not sticky at all. Very aromatic and a, and a lot of coconut flavor, if you can believe it. Just mixing it up. Uh, mix up, see, and then. And eat it all together. Mm. I like it. There's no rigid rules. <laughs> no. The anchovy, it's been deep fried. It's super crunchy. And we're going to mix that with some of the rice and some other things. It'll give it some saltiness and some texture, I guess, some crunchiness, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm. That is awesome. Oh my god. That is spicy though. Get some chili in there, get some coconut rice. Mm. I'm gonna get wild and put an anchovy on there. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's a pretty good combo, right? Mm. Are you proud of me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get to use it. It's all about that rice. It's so delicate, it's fluffy, and it has that radiant coconut flavor in there. Usually for breakfast, I have Cheerios. Have you heard of Cheerios? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Maybe later, next time you will have to try also, huh? <laughs> it's my new favorite breakfast. I love it. Thank you so much. This is a really cool experience for me. Yeah, that's good. I'm sure it was some kind of some kind of experience for you. Yeah. yeah. A because, little unusual. Uh, because eating then recording. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you don't usually come in here with a camera guy uh -huh. and some goofy looking white guy, but here we are. We're going to finish up breakfast. Coming up next, lunch. We're going, right. we're going on an adventure. First of all, you know, I got to Kuala Lumpur and I found of almost any city I'd been to, they had some of the nicest, uh, especially most chill taxi drivers I'd ever seen. Very friendly, cordial, and informative. And now we are with Mohammed. He's bringing us to one of his favorite lunch spots. There's these very different cultures together here. Correct. You know, there's yes, correct. Indian, Chinese, and uh, Malay people. Three different religions, yes. too. But can live together, you know. But they live together kind of can live together. harmoniously. Yes. Yeah, I like it. There's a good vibe here. This restaurant, the name is uh, Bonsa Kona. All right, let's check it out. Here, got the all food. You can choose. Wow! Yeah. So you just dish up whatever you want? Yes. Oh, uh, self-service? Yes, self-service. Okay. Can I go first, huh? Yeah. Self We've service. got a giant cooler just, full of rice just here. Just open this one. Not too much. Healthy, okay. must be healthy first. This first... Uh, Do you usually eat curry. with your hands? Yes, I am using my hand. Oh, let's try it's it. It's original, you know. It's very yeah. nice, very tasty. Yeah, I want to do that. We're going to pile that on with yeah. a plate. This heart of the chicken. Hot chicken. Oh, chicken heart. Yes. Yeah, okay, I like heart. What kind of curry is this? Yes. It's the chicken curry. Just chicken curry. Yes. I'll get some chicken hearts too. I always use the fish. La. Okay. Uh, because every time I eat the chicken, so sometimes I, uh, for the lunch, I eat the fish. Nice big fish here. Yes. It's, it's very spicy. Yes. All right, I'm, ex I'm really excited for that. And then this uh, vegetable, you know? Yeah, lots of vegetables. That's a lot of fiber. I'm going to get a medium amount of vegetables. Mana? Sambal belacan, mana? Oh, this one is sambal belacan. This is like a chili sauce. Yes, chili. It's a, like the chili sauce. Uh, it's okay. a hot, you know. Okay. Never mind. You put, put it on the side? You put it on. You put it on. Okay, yes. Alright, I'm gonna smell this. Okay, this one. Oh, that's you know pretty ulama. intense. Take this one first. Sure. Okay, mix this one. I'm seeing a lot of new for stuff you, today. You know for what you I'm saying? Healthy, you know. Alright, very healthy? Uh, yeah, yes. Good. That's all. I, that's all you, okay? That's good for me. Okay, bye. Alright, I just had breakfast. Alright, my man has brought this pan over. What is this for? It's for the put the water here. Okay. Oh, wash you your just hands. Wash your hand here. Just, just the right hand. I hit this there. Okay. Only the right hand. Yes. What do we use the left hand for? High okay, five. The first one, you open up this one first. All right. So this is my first time doing this with the meal mm. with just the bare hands. Yes. At least in Malaysia, I'm telling you, this takes a little bit of skill. So you just kind of mix up some vegetable, a little chili, a little rice, and you put it all together, and you put it right in here, yes. and that's it. Yes. Mmm. Spicy, huh? Yeah? Not yet, nah, not yet. Not too spicy. After a few seconds, after a few seconds, you feel it's spicy. Not directly spicy. Not super spicy, no. Yes, after this. After this? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> it's like you want me to suffer. There's vegetable, there's rice, 
there's some of this chili sauce. There's one of these seeds from in here. All together, I'm gonna try to not be too messy, but I mean, Mmm. Eh. Do they have a sink? Before you wash, you must. Really? <laughs> when you shake hands with somebody, yes. what hand do you use? Right hand. Right hand. Everything right hand. Right, everything right hand. Okay. Bathroom, left hand. Yes, of course. Ah, I cracked the code. So here, the fish, does this still have all the guts? No, it's uh, dirty, you know. But some countries, they don't they don't take it out. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> crazy. Like, somebody's normal is always somebody else's crazy. Hmm. All right, let's try it. Oh, sh I used my left hand. You are wrong. I am not good at this yet. I need to be like in Rocky 2, where he tied his arm behind his back <laughs> when he got ready for his match. I need to become a self pie. Yeah, like this one. Uh. Oh, yo, there is a technique. There's some technique to yes, this. We must learn the technique. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here I got a nice piece of fish, yeah, bean, push up. rice, vegetable, and I'm gonna just flick that right into the food bin. Mmm. Good. Success. Wow. This is kind of fun. It's got some nice kick to it. It's, all this is like fairly spicy. Very fast, you learn. Very good. Thank you, sir. Oh, look at that. Look at that bite. Some chicken heart. Mmm. Very good. You want to eat the uh, sambal blood, Jan? Yeah. You want to eat, huh? Yeah. You eat. I, More. I take the okay. sambal blood, Jan. Eat, okay. eat again. Yeah. Oh, he's really testing me. Okay, so. The sambal bachan, really spicy sauce here. Oh, very spicy one. And he looked at me, he asked me three times in a row if I was sure that I wanted more. I said yes. Now, he must think I can't handle the spiciness. But bro, let me tell you, I can handle it. I can handle it. Let's do this. Maybe, oh, there we go. It's there. Mix one. Okay. We've got some liver, we got some rice, and plenty of sambal bachan. You ready? Yes. Let's both take a big bite. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> That's a winner. High five? Yes. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. How much do you think it would cost for a plate like this? Almost uh, eight ringgit. Oh, so like two dollars? Yes. For all this? Yes. Not so bad. dollar only, not bad. Ooh, that chili. Fantastic. When I come somewhere new, when I see all these containers, yes. I feel a little intimidated. I look at it all. I don't know what goes together. I don't know if there's certain rules. And so then I usually just go get a corn dog and, uh, and I sit in my hotel room and I cry. But now you're here, you showed me the way and now I know how to do it. So next time I'll be okay on my own, okay? High five to you guys. We'll see you next time. And then together, can we say peace? A peace. A peace. Nice, okay. nailed it.